75 degrees. Mostly sunny, little change in temperature Wednesday, the high in the mid-90s. Winds southerly to southwesterly, 8 to 15 miles per hour today. The outlook for Thursday, mostly sunny and not quite so warm. The current KXOK Radio Park temperature is 98 degrees. This has been news brought to you on KXOK Radio. Listen for news continually on this station. KXOK News will pay if you're the top news tipper of the day. A check from KXOK is now on its way to... Tom Prentice of Edwardsville, Illinois. If you see news happen, call KXOK News at FO15965. It's 5 o'clock. Try again, everybody. 5 o'clock in St. Louis. The Mockingbird, INS Fox. Boyd, and that's little Inez Fox on Radio 63. Inez, number 21 on the Top 40 Survey. Gee, she's a pretty girl. It's three minutes past five o'clock on the Top 40 Survey Show. As a community service, KXOK reminds you that the St. Louis City Hospital School of Nursing offers a generous educational reward to its third-year nursing students. Write for admission information to the director, St. Louis City Hospital School of Nursing, 1515 Lafayette, St. Louis 4, Missouri. If you have an announcement to be made, mail it to Bulletin Board, KXOK. And as a personal service, here's another note of interest. And the annual St. Peter's Community Chamber of Commerce picnic will be held at all Saints Picnic Grounds on Sunday, August 11th. Dinner will be served at 8.30 p.m. And dancing will highlight the evening. It's now about three and a half minutes past five o'clock. Otis with the Top 40 Survey Show. Now we go to the midway point to number 20 on the Top 40 Survey. These are the classics. Till then. <laughs>
on the Top 40 survey at the midway point in that Top 40 survey. Six minutes past five on KXOK. This is Spencer Allen inviting you to be watching Channel 4 tonight when the 10 o'clock news doubles in length to bring you more local, national, international, and sports news. My news broadcast increases to 20 minutes and will be followed by the weather with Jim Bolin. A new and pointed feature, Eyeline Max Roby is next with a nightly report on issues and personalities of special interest to residents of the greater St. Louis area. That's tonight when the 10 o'clock news doubles on KMOX-TV, Channel 4. Seven minutes past five o'clock. Drive extremely careful on those highways, byways, and expressways. The last count, we still had uh, traffic confusion on Eads Bridge, so if you can possibly skirt Eads Bridge for just a little while longer, why, everything will be back to normal. Now, the most listened to radio station in the great Midwest publishes weekly the most accurate and dependable survey of the best-selling and most requested songs of the St. Louis area. Get your copy every week. It's available at most record shops and department stores. Just ask for the latest KXOK Top 63 sing-along survey. If the place where you buy records does not carry the KXOK Top 63 survey, just write us or tell them to write us and we'll see that they have a new stack every week. Printed on this week's uh, Top 63 sing-along survey, the lyrics to Bobby Bear's Detroit City. Get yourself a copy. It's free. It seems to me I think we heard this before. <laughs> the classics until then, kids. I tell you what, let's... Eugene Chandler of Man's Temptation. One more time to test the real power of me.
Temptation. And that's Gene Chandler's 18 on the top 40 survey from KXOK. It's 10 minutes past 5 o'clock. 19 on the top 40 survey was be careful of the stones that you throw Dion. Here's the best musical invitation in filter right smoking today. Yes, treat your taste kindly with Kent. Because Kent, with the new Micronite filter, refines away harsh flavor, refines away rough taste for the mildest taste of all. Remember, the finer the filter, the milder the taste. Treat your taste kindly with Kent Smoke Kent, the Micronite filter cigarette. Treat your taste kindly with Kent. Hello. <laughs> The funniest feeling in the world. You go you go to trigger something and it ain't there. Try this. No matter what the time or place, just keep up with that happy taste. Get real action, seven up your thirst away. Any thirst you can get, seven up can quench. Seven up is all action. It tingles. It freshens. With seven up you get real action. Get real action, seven up your thirst. Hey, 12 minutes past 5 o'clock on, on a KXOK Top 40 survey show on Ray Otis's show, Snow Knows. The Hitmaker Station, the new 63 KXOK, is proud to present the number one song to be the pick hit of the week. Johnny Tillotson. You can take my picture off your shelf. Stop me loving you. You can never stop the way that my heart's beating to. You can never stop me loving you. That's one thing you never do. You can look away when I pass by. Tillotson, the brand new pick hit of the week on Radio 63. You will never stop me from loving you. It's brand new and it's the pick hit on Radio 63. <laughs> Otis and Company with the Top 40 Survey Show. 
Come and get it. Get Mall's Barbecue Sauce, the best barbecue sauce in town. Use Mall's regular and Mall's smoky barbecue sauce. And partly cloudy this afternoon and tonight with no important temperature change. High this afternoon in the mid-90s, low for tonight about 70 to 75. Mostly sunny, little temperature change on Wednesday with a high in the mid-90s. To the uh, outlook for Thursday, mostly sunny and not quite so warm. At Radio Park, 95 degrees. Yeah. 17. Yeah. survey from one of America's top five radio stations. The home of the gooder guys. The Dodge boys at Ray Richmond's Dodge City have a whale of a finance plan which lets you keep your cash and still drive a new 63 Dodge. With the Richmond payment plan, you pick your terms. With qualified credit, no money down, no payments for three, six, or nine months, up to a year. Payments as low as $39 a month on the 63 Dodge Dart for less than $18.85, plus five-year or 50,000-mile warranty. Win a 63 Dodge. No obligation to buy. Guess the number of jelly beans in the big jar at the Ray Richmond Dodge City, 7916 North Broadway, open Monday through Saturday till 10 p.m. Nineteen minutes past five o'clock on Radio 63. The latest uh, traffic report from Essential News indicates this, that traffic is moving free and clear pretty much so on the Eads Bridge and no major traffic tie-up reported in the rest of the St. Louis area. So keep it nice, keep it that way. Traffic a little bit, a little bit heavier than usual at this point. So drive extra careful. Here's the guy who knows the score. <laughs> Now the KXOK baseball scoreboard. The Cardinals take on the Mets of New York tonight in the first of a three-day stand. Kurt Simmons and Galen Sisko pitching for both teams. Los Angeles beats Chicago 4-1 to one today to enhance their chances. San Francisco and Houston meet tonight. Milwaukee and Pittsburgh, Cincinnati and Philadelphia. Cincy and Philly, by the way, in a doubleheader. In the American League, New York at Washington in a doubleheader. Cleveland at Baltimore in single games, as is Chicago and Kansas City. Boston and Detroit. And Minnesota and Los Angeles. And that's the KXOK baseball scoreboard on... KXOK Sports of the Day. 
16, Marvin Gaye. Ride and joy. Enjoy it. That's Marvin Gaye on Radio 63 and 16 on the Top 40 survey. 22 minutes now past 5 o'clock. We have on the phone handsome Harry Slavin at the Miss Rainey Afton store at 9516 Gravoy. Hi, Harry. Fine. Tremendous sale underway. Tell us about the tremendous prices. Well, we got some real good prices. Ray, the only thing is we neglected to tell you about our freezer sale. Yeah. Uh, we've got a big variety of freezers. For an example, I have a 160-pound chest freezer here. We're selling for a low price of $119.95. I have some 12 foot upright hot point porcelain interior models as low as $165. We have some 18 foot boxes. These are the big family size jobs. 18 cubic foot upright hot point for a low price of $228. That's just an example of some of the big savings we're giving. You got some TV sets out there? Oh, we got TVs. I think we got the, probably the, the, the. I know for a fact we've got the largest selection of TVs in the in the St. Louis County out here in Afton. Uh, and of course we have all top brand names such as RCA, Zenith, Emerson, all good sets, Ray. And uh, just a few of them here I'll mention on the phone is, uh, for example, we've got a Consolet Zenith here, 23 inch, 64 model, swivel model. It's a beautiful cabinet, a $269 value for 188.88. That's a Zenith, which is, of yeah, course, everyone knows that's the very best money can buy. That's the Zenith in television, friend. Right. Uh, let's see. What about what about if I want to pick up a, a, a portable television portable? set for my wife? Fine. We've got a large selection, and we've got some brand new lightweight models here. These are the uh, 14-pound jobs, 17-inch for $99.95. Hey, what about financing? We do our own financing rate up to 36 months to pay, and... Really, what's good about it, Ray, there's no, uh, the finance charges are very low. If, if you'll check on it, you'll see it's 2 and 3% lower than, gee, most banks and any other finance company in town. So uh, it's not a, a big rate since we do our own financing. We save you a lot of money on that, too. Okay, so we're going to send them out there and service after the sale as well as a must at Ms. Rainey. See my friend Harry Sliman. Harry, how late are you going to be open tonight? We'll be open till 9 o'clock, Ray. Okay, that's at 9516 Gravoy in Afton. Tell Harry that Ray Oda sent you. Right. And you won't hit him with a mop or anything, right? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's leaving home to see... 
Gidget goes to roll. Yes, that new grown-up Gidget and her swinging friends bring a brand new twist to love in the glamour capital of the world. From the dazzling Via Veneto to the fabulous Fountain of Trevi, they're a wow with that wild Dolce Vita crowd. In Columbia Pictures, Gidget goes to roll. She swoons over a Roman Romeo. That's me. She fractures a fashion show. That's me. She triggers a tempest at the American Embassy. That's me. Gidget goes to Rome, starring James Darren. And introducing that new grown-up Gidget, Cindy Carroll. In spectacular scenic color, Gidget goes to Rome. A first-run premiere starts this Wednesday at 15 theaters, including the Airway, Broadway, 66 Park Inn South Twin, and Thunderbird Drive-Ins. You know, I guess every time they come out with a movie, they have a different Gidget, right? Well, I'm going to be a Gadget. Little Stevie in the top five tonight between six and seven. It's 28 and a half minutes past five o'clock. Go to Spill. Listen to that engine idle. That's what you'll hear when STP is added to the oil. protection insist on STP. It's so incredible. It's so incredibly fabulous. 
fantastic. He's so gigantic, we made so drastic. What are you talking about? KXOK. St. Louis, Missouri. This is KXOK's Keith Lawrence with the news in brief. Dentist found dead. The 64-year-old dentist from University City died of a gunshot wound in his St. Louis office today. Details at five of the hour. Fire on the river. St. Louis firemen brought under control late today a four-alarm fire which raged through double-deck barge frequently tied to the steamster Admiral. Haitian Command reports. The Haitian Rebel Command reports its armed invasion force and army deserters joining it have massed before the, ne- uh, the Republic's second city, Cap Hayton, and have probed beyond it. Senate votes. The Senate has voted unanimously for a hefty pay raise for most of the persons now serving in the nation's fighting forces. Kennedy sends treaty to the Senate. The White House says President Kennedy will send the new partial nuclear test ban treaty to the Senate on Thursday. State Department talks. The State Department says talks on problems blocking normal U.S. relations with communist Hungary are being conducted through the American legation in Budapest. A revised forecast for KXOK. Partly cloudy tonight, no important change in temperature. The low tonight, 70 to 75 degrees. Mostly sunny, little change in temperature on Wednesday, the high in the mid-90s. The current KXOK radio park temperature is 94 degrees. This has been News in Brief. Details at five minutes before the hour on... Essential News from KXOK. Radio 63. True confession, that's the Babbling Brook Benton on Radio 63. Mark Brooks, boy, at 15 on that top 40 survey. It's 27 minutes now before that happy market six on Radio 63. Get the six with the cool green patch. P.F. 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 Catch it down with the patch to match. And swing the B.F. I want you to get PF tennis shoes. You know, it's almost time for back to school, and everybody will be in need of tennis shoes, right? Because probably the tennis shoes he had last year are all shot. I want you to get the tennis shoes that are perfect for you. PF's Posture Foundation. 
These are the tennis shoes and the only tennis shoes that give your feet the kind of support that they need. And it's uh, all done because of a little thing in uh, in the middle of the of the shoe, in the, in the sole itself, that will give you the support. I wear them. I like them. They give my feet that added extra lift and that added extra comfort that, that feet need, active feet. And uh, for the girls, you know, uh, not only back to school and for, you know, for active uh, phys... Uh, phys ed programs and sports, but also for sportswear itself. When you when you knock it around, you want something uh, with a with a with a clever style. PFs have it. PFs means posture, foundation, and also perfect fit and beautiful styling. They've got a new uh, new color that really knocks me out. It's cranberry, and they've got unique styles that are for you. Cranberry, by the way, is is the in color for fall. They also have a, another one called the PF Bayshore in classic white to match white jeans. Gee, the whole trend is to, you know, matching the tennis shoes with the outfit. And PF is set for you. They're ready for you. Once you do this, drop in at your PF dealer and check over the line of PF tennis shoes. And remember what I said, they're the shoes that should be on your feet. And you look for that little green patch on the heel. It's the trademark of the sneakers made in America by BF Goodrich Footwear Company. PF. And taste that little green label. Swing the DF way, steady. Swing the DF way. Get the seats with the cool green patch and swing the DF way. And listen, this week I'm going to give away a pair of PF tennis shoes to somebody. If you'll just guess my shoe size, guess the exact shoe size, the uh, earliest postmarked card with the correct answer will win a pair of PF tennis shoes. And I want the exact size now. And it's pretty difficult to guess. So you get thinking right now. <laughs> Okay, presents the job finder. This week we have 126 openings for qualified draftsmen in the mechanical, structural, and cartographic fields. Must have at least one year of recent experience. The average salary is approximately 400 per month, the top 600 per month. Appointment arranged to suit your convenience. Ask for Mr. McGinnis, Professional Placement Center, Missouri State Employment Service, 505 Washington Avenue. If you're looking for a position, listen for KXOK's Job Finder. 14 on the top 40 survey from KXOK, Georgie Hamilton, the fourth Abilene. Hamilton the 4th in Abilene on Radio 63 and 14 on the Top 40 survey from KXOK. It's 21 minutes before 6. It's Radio 63. 
Jim Heston, Ava Gardner, David Niven. Keep a date with destiny in the forbidden city of Peking. Heston as the Mobeen who hurled his way through slashing swords to Peking's mysterious gates. Ava Gardner, the adventuress he met there, her past scarred by the embraces of men she had known before. Fifty-five days at Peking, giant among motion pictures, the dazzling splendor of the Dragon Empire, terrorizing mobs storming its mighty walls, flaming action, exotic passions. Famed columnist Hedda Hopper calls it a smash, a knockout. Samuel Bronston presents 55 Days at Peking in Super Technorama Technicolor. It starts tomorrow at 13 theaters in Greater St. Louis, including the Maplewood, Rio, Granada, and Plaza Drive-Ins in St. Charles. It's not 20 minutes before 6 o'clock on KXOK. Ray Otis with the Top 40 Survey at 13. I've been a searching all this big wide world. Now finally I found my... Girl on Radio 63. It's now 18 minutes before 6 o'clock. Wherever you are on this great, wide, wonderful day, drive extra careful, won't you? That life you save might be your own, friend. When the taste has been, people have been, the people have Given a blast, get refreshment to last. Coca-Cola in half quarts, just one eight bottle carton. Gives you 24 servings over ice for practically three cents a glass. Get cartons of Coke in that thirst bust in half quart size today. Your best soft drink value. This is Benny King, an extra in the top 40. I, who have nothing. I'll have nothing I'll have no one Adore you And want you so I'm just a no one With nothing to give you but all Bye. 
as you dance Bright Sparkling dance But believe me Dear when I say Then he can give you the world But he'll never love you the way I love you He can take you any place he wants To fancy clubs and restaurants But I can only watch you win My nose pressed up against the window pane. I, I will have nothing. I, I who am no one must watch you go dancing by. Wrapped in the arms of somebody else When darling is I Who loves me And that's Benny King and I Who have nothing at 15 minutes before 6 o'clock, Ray Otis with the Top 40 Survey Show from KXOK. Forecast calls for partly cloudy this afternoon and tonight with no important temperature change. High this afternoon, we had about a 98. Low for tonight, about 70 to 75. Mostly sunny, little temperature change Wednesday with a high in the mid-90s. Outlook for Thursday, mostly sunny and not quite so warm. At Radio Park, it's 94 beautiful degrees. <laughs> If you want the finest value every dollar can buy, go to Sears, go to Sears, go to Sears. If you want the best selection, easy credit, oh my, go to Sears, go to Sears, go to Sears. Every purchase that you make has a guarantee. Friendly service at Sears is a specialty. When you walk out the door, you will say, what a store. Go to Sears, go to Sears, go to Sears. Home furnishings, brilliantly styled with an accent on quality and value. They're all yours during Sears' August Furniture Festival. Save on select hardwood furniture, beautifully crafted with solid maple tops. Your choice, just $39.66. Full-size bed and nightstand, wagon wheel bunk bed, 44-inch desk, and other select pieces. Your choice, just $39.66. Now at Sears. When you walk out the door, you will say, what a store. Go to Sears, go to Sears, go to Sears. It's 13 minutes before five o'clock, uh, before 6 o'clock on Radio 60. The five o'clock, if you're listening, you know, somewhere in Joplin. It's uh, a good sign to see Ben Colder popping up here because he's at still number two. And you know what that means. Oh, you took my car, Steve. I know you won't get far, you be sitting still. <laughs> still, when a mile is past, you'll run out of gas, you I've lost count of the hours, and I've lost track of the time. And you know why, darling? I lost my watch. In fact, I lost a lot of things when you went away. What are you going to do with all my junk? But still, I cling to the memory of when we used to go together. Why I must have gone with you that something I can't even remember what I went with you for. But I do remember the night when we'd stroll hand in hand and I'd look up at the sky and recite your favorite poem. Starkle, starkle, little twink. Uh, oh yeah, that, that reminds me. I've been reading so much about the evils of drinking that I've decided to give it up. So I quit reading. Now I don't drink anything stronger than pop. 
Of course, pop will drink just about anything. Still, I wish I had a still. And then every day, I run my still. This flame in my heart is like an eternal fire. It's the worst case of heartburn I've ever had. And I haven't been able to put out not one little flicker. Not even with all this fear, I mean tears. My friends think that I'm crazy. <laughs> well, maybe I am. But I'll carry this torch just as long as I can. But you know that one of these days it's going to get awful short. And if I don't drop it, well, someday you may just come home and find that I've made an ash of myself. Still, though I told this torch, still, it's beginning to scorch. Burns, too. That's Ben Colder on Radio 63 at number 12 on the Top 40 survey still. Monkeys separate the men from the boys, but not from the girls. Greatest case that you can find, LSMFT is why. Monkeys separate the men from the boys, but not from the girls. Mr. Right. Smoking's a pleasure meant for adults, and Lucky's are blended for adult taste. If you're an adult smoker, remember, LSMFT. Lucky Strike means fine tobacco, all the rich, full-bodied taste you could ask for. It's about eight minutes now before that happy mark at six o'clock on Radio 63. Ray Otis with the brand new Top 40 survey. I know you're on way on your I know you're on your way home from work right now. I just want to remind you that Davy O'Donnell pokes around the airwaves from six to ten every morning on Radio 63. He's got far and away, far and away. I opened my mouth a little bit. Far and away, the top-rated morning show in Mid America. So you be sure now to hear the spectacular Davy O'Donnell show from six to ten Monday through Saturday. <laughs> It's a known fact that the only way to get the most accurate and dependable survey of the best-selling and most requested songs in the St. Louis area is from a KXOK Top 63 sing-along survey, published weekly and available at most record shops and department stores. Be sure to ask for the latest KXOK Top 63 survey wherever you buy records. There's something special on every one. On the reverse side of the Top 63 sing-along survey, you'll find the lyrics to Bobby Bear's famous Detroit City. Hey, that's okay. The home of the gooder guys, Radio 63. Ray Otis with the Top 40 survey between 6 and 7 tonight, the Top 10. Now let's turn to number 11 on that Top 40 survey, the great sounds of the Yorlons. Saw him last Saturday night on stage at the KXOK Super Summer All-Star Show. Not me, baby. <laughs> Okay. 
is KXLK's Keith Morris. I have news for you. St. Louis, the steamer Admiral is safe, but her repair barge could stand a little work. That's the big story. I'll have the details in just minutes. Dentist found murdered. A 64-year-old dentist from University City died of a gunshot wound today. Police told KXOK News that he was found in his St. Louis office apparently murdered. His name? Dr. Charles Lyne of 1141 Wilshire Lane. Homicide detectives said that Dr. Lane was found in his office at 4264 Manchester Avenue by an anonymous caller who notified police. There was a wound under his left arm, but the police found no gun. Escapee pleaded innocent. A Missouri penitentiary escapee who shot a Liberty policeman and abducted a hostage pleaded innocent today to felonious assault and armed robbery. He is Nash Jonas Israel, age 53, of Kansas City, who escaped from a prison farm July 5th while serving a third term for burglary. Israel pleaded in magistrate court in North Kansas City. He was unable to make $20,000 bond, returned to the Clay County Jail for preliminary hearing August 2nd. Israel tried to force Sergeant Eldon Jack Petty, Liberty's assistant police chief, to drive him to Kansas City when he stopped to question the fugitive yesterday. Israel shot and wounded Petty in the arm when the officer drove into a filling station with him. Israel then forced a gasoline customer, Willard Merrifield, to drive off with him. Merrifield did some fast talking and convinced the convict he would return with food and gasoline if Israel let him drive into Lathrop. Instead, he notified police and Israel was captured a short time later. Man and wife shoot each other. A St. Louis man and his wife shot each other during an argument at their home at 5639 Mobeda today, but their injuries are not serious. Police say William Brooks, age 33, and his wife Clara, age 32, were taken to City Hospital No. 2 with bullet wounds in their legs. Officers charged Brooks with carrying a concealed weapon. Both Williams and his wife with discharging, with discharging a firearm in the city and assault with intent to kill. You are listening to Total Information from KXOK. Woman question. A rural Centralia, Illinois woman was held today for questioning after officials said her husband was pinned under a car that may have been driven at him in a bean field earlier today. Sheriff D.E. Barton of Jefferson County said the woman, 48-year-old Esther Sanders, declined to discuss the matter. The car, he said, was driven through a fence near the Sanders farm. Her husband, Kermit, was hospitalized, but was reported not in critical condition. And now the big story. St. Louis firemen brought under control late today a four-alarm fire which raged through a double-deck barge frequently used and tied to the steamer Admiral. The Admiral is Mississippi River's largest pleasure boat. The Admiral was safely moored 100 yards downstream at the time of the blaze of undetermined origin, which broke out about 3 o'clock. For a half an hour, the fire sent thick columns of black smoke high into the air along the riverfront before firemen brought it under control. Captain Roy Struckfuss, in an exclusive interview, interview heard earlier on uh, KXOK, the barge manager, said damage would amount to about twenty-five dollars to $35,000. No firemen were injured. One, no one was aboard the barge at the time. A report now from the scene from KXOK's Stephen B. Stevens. There is nothing but a twisted pile of machinery aboard the maintenance barge of the SS Admiral. Firemen have been pumping water out of the 150-foot-long craft to keep it from sinking. There is no damage estimate on the machinery, but Captain Roy Streckfuss, the president and general manager of Streckfuss Steamers, says damage other than the machinery will run about $25,000 or more. There is a major traffic tie-up in the area, specifically on each bridge. If you can avoid it, do so. This is Stephen B. Stevens on the scene. The barge was moored just upriver from the Eads Bridge. The Admiral was just south of the bridge. The barge became a blackened hulk, sunk halfway into the muddy river. It was a flat boat with housing built above the first deck. Twisted machinery warped by the blaze and charred wood appeared inside the 150-foot-long barge. The 50-foot-wide deck was buckled in the middle. Firemen pumped water from the barge to prevent it sinking. Only heavy rope cables tying it to the bank kept it afloat, firemen said. The barge about 30 years old and has a wood hull. It's frequently...